Well, it's one of the deadliest forms of cancer, and it attacks our heroes at some of the highest rates. Close to three out of four patients diagnosed with esophageal cancer will die, and firefighters and 60 percent more likely to contract this disease. But as Bo Evans shows us, a new test says that it can detect this type of cancer before it appears. You know, as firefighters, I think we're about five times more likely to develop cancer. Esophageal cancer is a gruesome type of cancer. Firefighters run towards danger, but who's protecting them from what comes after the fight? Our firefighters are exposed um, through their bravery to uh, lots of toxins. Dr. Lishan Asklog is a cardiothoracic surgeon. We know that they have an increased risk of cancers in general. One of the cancers where that risk is particularly elevated is esophageal cancer. Who's seen firsthand what esophageal cancer can do. And esophageal cancer is a real bad actor. It's a real deadly, lethal cancer. It's the second most lethal cancer. And it's been skyrocketing. About 80% of people will die. It's essentially a death sentence to get one of these, one of these cancers. He and his team have developed a new test designed to detect the cancer before it spreads. It's a big deal, but think small. This capsule here, about the size of a multivitamin. Uh, when we use this capsule, I ask the patient to swallow the capsule with water. It goes down into the stomach. I scoop up the cells, and then we bring it back out. It's called the Essegard test, and this little capsule pulls cells from your stomach and esophagus that get analyzed for precancer. If any are detected, it's relatively easy to eliminate with an endoscopy. Made your throat tickle a little bit. Sherry Hawk is the battalion chief for the EMS unit of Fort Worth FD. She knows a little throat tickle is worth saving a life. If it helps one, or one person in our department catch something early, I think it's worth it for all of us to do. 90 seconds to save a hero's life. In Fort Worth, Bo Evans, CBS News, Texas. Bo, well, thank you so much. Well, that test again is called the ESO Guard test, and it's been granted approval by the FDA now. And it's not just available for firefighters. If you're worried about esophageal cancer, just ask your doctor about this.